Super Nerds, Episode 1, The Dungeon Planet. It is spring of 2000. Our heroes, Gail and Leslie, enjoy the womb-like security of the Dungeon Planet comic book store. Their friendship has weathered the cruel taunts of classmates, the icy indifference of females, the unspeakable horror of the wild, wild west, and the ultimate betrayal of the Phantom Menace. Even now, as these two hapless bastards unroll this scroll, forces have been aligning against them since birth. Gail, cut it out. There's no trap door on that thing. Those ice cubes aren't guardian demons that you're slaying with your magic straw. You don't have to... All right, attack. I get it. Man, this new issue of Dark Bitch sucks worse than the first two did. Yeah, well, put it down. And the first issue of a comic sucks. I don't keep reading to see how bad the 20th issue sucks. Well, I give the creators a little more leeway. I have a four-issue rule. Yeah, you're a four-issue fool. You're a one-issue tool. <laughs> Leslie, did you get the passes for the convention? Yeah, dealer's passes. <laughs> I can't wait for the costume competition. <laughs> yeah, which character from ElfQuest are you going as? Can I finish? I can't wait for the costume competition to make fun of it. Oh, yeah. The wonderful alternate universe of overweight sci-fi characters. <laughs> <laughs> like Jedi Master Obi Chubb Kenobi. <laughs> yeah, I remember feared bounty hunter Boba Fat. Oh, he was no match for Fat Vader. <laughs> yeah, what about the captivating antics of R2 Fatso? <laughs> <laughs> I submit our shared memory of Princess Leia or Fata. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and the blind navigator Jordy the Fat. <laughs> <laughs> So are we out of the Star Wars universe now and into Star Trek? No. So. Okay, but no. No, because I... No, because I want both. I want... Yes. They're only good as a set. But that's why I'm getting both. Okay. So I'll, I'll see you and then both. Okay. Both. Bye. What was that about? Both what? Oh, it's just something stupid. Mm. Hello, bodies. Hey, Vosgen. Here to take a crap? It's my store, buddy. I take as many craps in my bathroom, in my store, in my mini mall as I want. What is she doing here? She's Pamela Lee hot. She's Rebecca Romaine hot. She's Pamela Lee making out with Rebecca Romaine hot. Dude, she's Pamela and Rebecca and Laura Croft making out on top of a fire truck. Do you guys have Pokemon? My son loves that. She's in seven or gay. <clears throat> Ma'am? Uh-huh. Uh... Um, I, I, I... I'll handle this. <laughs> oh, my God, look. This is the van from Scooby-Doo. Uh, it's called the Mystery Machine. Don't take it out of the bag. <laughs> okay. Wow, this place is... This is like a kid's paradise. It's not just kids who come in here. <laughs> I mean, there's collectors, you know. There's a lot of money to be made. I used to be into this stuff. I'm not anymore. I mean, when I was a kid, I just came to visit my friend. Hi. Oh, sorry. I'm Gail. This is Leslie. Funny story. We actually met through our love of comic books and sci-fi and kung fu. 
Hey, do you think Daredevil could beat up Bruce Lee? No way, oh. man. Bruce oh. Lee got some monkey style. Well, I, I don't know, dude. Daredevil almost beat up Wolverine last month. And that was the first time we got beaten up together. So, are you a divorced or um? Are you divorced or widowed? And if so, can I be your new husband? Yeah, well, here's you. Pretty lady, can't talk, must not soil pants. This is you. Hi, I'm Gail. Date me. <laughs> Date me. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, boy. Two hotties in one day? Is somebody playing a prank on us? <laughs> it's not my birthday. Spider-Bat have brain of idiot. Why does this idiot waste bulk powers punching rubbers? If Super Spider bite me, I charge everybody money. What are you talking about? Give me money, I pick up bus. Give me money, I come to your party, run up and down wall like big bug, everybody pointing, saying, oh, look at the bug man, it's best party, give him some money. That's a complete bastardization of radioactive blood. Listen, I am businessman, I am gifted this way. Maybe I was bitten by radio control business bug when I was little. <laughs> look, I come to America number one. I make money, I send for my brother Jorge, I do good. What about the rest of your family? They were killed, some kind of war. I go check on the rest of Minimo. Hey, what was your brother's name again? Jorge. No, you're gay. <laughs> <laughs> like, hold on. Why don't you make like clown and go rape school? <laughs> hey, the hotties in new comics. Oh, she's a genius. She's a mastermind. Hi, do you have to come No. Home? I'm just looking no. for... No. This store sucks my farts. No. <laughs> oh, dark bitch. Sucks. No, I know, but it's only the third issue. I got a four-issue rule for new comics. <laughs> I wish more people felt that way. Hey, you got any new eight ball? Well, um, we, uh... New the... comics come out on Wednesday. Uh, um, well, I'll just get this then, Leslie. What did you call him? I called him Leslie. Gail. What? You guys don't recognize me, do you? You're not a former gentleman, are you? Gail, that's some good awkward. I went to junior high with you guys. Enough said. When? Attention, attention. Come on, guys. We have a new member petitioning to join. All in favor, say Excelsior. <laughs> Excelsior. All opposed, say enough said. Enough said. I wouldn't take it personally. This is probably the only chance they'll ever have to exclude anyone. You were the only one who was ever half decent to me. If I could have seen the future, I would have said Excelsior. <laughs> so is this your store? Man, he just manages it. Dungeon Planet, that's a cool name. What's well, on my shirt also. <laughs> well, it was great to see you, and uh, I live here again now, so... I'll definitely be back. Oh, well, I... Um, God, see my shirt? This is where I keep pie. <laughs> nice one, Corky. She'll never be back. Employees only behind the counter.
Look at that smug little hobbit sitting there dreaming about all the hot, nasty, deviant sex he's going to have with Gwen. No fair. Oh, finally going to happen to me. Once I get those Resident Evil cheat codes, it's hello level four. <laughs> hello, Dungeon Master. Hello, Crimson Beard the Viking. Hello, Blood Gusher. Master, do you have another challenging adventure planned for us on Saturday? Full of fabulous treasures and diabolical man traps? There are two things I take very seriously. Dungeons and dragons. Good. Here's two more things you take seriously. James Tiberius and Jean-Luc. Kirk and Picard bookends? Those are limited release. Yep. eBay is a sweet thing. But you don't even like Star Trek. Yeah, but I figured I could sell them to you guys. You guys, you said on the phone you would sell them to me, both of them. Well, I want them too, both of them. Really? Well, eBay has awakened the spirit of bidding in me. Let's have an auction. What am I bid for these two? You know how much money we have. I'll pay 85, so give them to me. Wait, 90 is all I have. Gentlemen, it's a beautiful rendering of the legendary Starship Captain. His steely eyes alone are worth $90. Wait a minute, today... this just for the one? I'm selling them separately. I don't want just one. You said I on know the phone. what we talked about, but I must respect the demands of the current market. Do you see what you did? $30. 33 35. 35. Going. Going. No, wait. You have to wait for a pause. I'll go 38. 38. Going. Going. 40. And don't start saying going, going. It's more exciting that way. 42, douche nozzle. 44, anima king. 45, colostomy queen. 48, you bed crap and water brain. Damn it. That's what? That was a pause. 48. Going once. Going twice. 50, you Jar Jar loving butt nut. Sold for 50 bucks. One down, one to go, on with the show. Let's start bidding at, uh... Forty-two dollars. You know I only have forty! <laughs> now that was a pause, Marianne. Forty-two, going once, going twice... Sixty dollar! What? Hey, this is a private auction. No, it isn't. Sixty dollar. You don't even know what these things are. They must be good business. Look how much you guys spend. You have no money. Oh, this sucks. Sixty, going once. Wait a minute, how much do you have? One hundred and twenty. One twenty-five. Shut up, here's forty. We'll share custody. 125 going once. Uh, I don't know. Going twice. Dude, come on. Okay. All right, 160. 162. <laughs> 165. Uh, Vaskin, please. You Mickey Ficky laundry monkey. Your insults are like roses at the feet of Vaskin, the king of businessmen. Going once, twice, thrice. Feels so nice. Sold for 165. <laughs> Gentlemen, thank you. Mr. Vaskin. Yeah, here's money. Go buy cookie dough. <laughs> You suck, Joe! Yeah, all the way to the bank. Who is this guy again? Captain Pumpkin? Oh, man. Why did you even bother buying it? I overhear Chub Club saying it's worth $350. I make big profit. These are worth more than money. Nothing is worth more than money. Except heroin. Mark up to 400 And no deals for friends. Bye-bye. <laughs> well, you royally screwed that up. Having just Kirk sucks. What do you care? You got one bookend and a girl that likes you. What girl likes me? Gwen. You sticking up for her and all. Man, she thinks you're a hero. And now Vosgen has this bookend and he thinks it's from a show called Star Train. These two should never be separated. Do you really think she likes me? Man, if there's one thing I know, it's when a hot girl likes someone else and not me! <laughs> Guess who's going to pay for that? Huh? Not me! <laughs> what? I was just thinking, if this was some turdy sitcom, I would have been up all last night trying to glue that back together. Hey, guys. Hey, Leslie. Hey. Why brings you here? 
It's New Comics Day, right? Yeah, every Wednesday. <laughs> yeah, except for when there's some crappy government or religious holiday three people care about. Hey, Leslie, are you going to the comic book convention this weekend? Well, <laughs> yeah, that'd be great. I'm going to enter a costume competition. Those are so much fun. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, maybe maybe we could go together, like you could be Batman and I could be Catwoman. Or... Catwoman is a villain. <laughs> or you could be Green Lantern and I could be, um, like, Scarlet Witch. <laughs> um, Scarlet Witch is Marvel and Green Lantern is DC. <laughs> okay, maybe it's a crossover thing. What's the difference? <laughs> there's a huge difference! Every time there's a crossover, it doesn't work. Know why? Because their powers aren't analogous. You're talking two separate universes! Okay. I'm... I'm gonna... He... he... he um, so, should we carpool down together, or...? What? Half of me wants to commend you on your steadfast principles in never mixing Marvel and DC. What about the other half? The other half wishes I had Wolverine powers so I could cut off your head with my adamantium claws. Uh, it's adamantium? Fine, you win. Who's keeping score? Me! Hoskin, give it up. Right, your, your steely gaze is not going to make time reverse. He's like when Beatles die. They're not all dead. Soon. Why must Vaskin suffer? Before you say anything... Let me say this before I say anything. This was my heart. You broke my Star Train heart. I brought a check for the 165. I was going to sell for 400. My profit is out the window. Here's the deal. You pay me $50 and you never set foot in store again. Is insult? Yes. Yes? Is worth losing $350 to never see you again. Hurts, doesn't it? Tell your friends. <laughs> Fine, yeah, here's 50. Why did you take that deal? What, we can't hang out anymore? Oh, man, he'll forget about this in a week. You watch. You... Oh, all right, Do... watch the store. I'm going to lock up the back. Oh, hi, Gwen. Hi. Where's Leslie? Oh, I sent him on a soda run. Oh. If you would have been here earlier, I would have made him get you a Dr. Pepper. Yeah, well, I hate Dr. Pepper. Yeah, me too. I don't know why I said it. That's, that sucks. It's like... Is Leslie dating anyone right now? Yeah. Well, then what is it? Does he just not like me? What do you mean? I, I just mean that he was really nice to me, and then all of a sudden he, he, he just froze up, and, and I feel like if I were to ask him out, the answer would be no, and he'd say it as he was running away from me. Yeah, well, he would never go out with you. What? Why not? Because he knows I like you. You like me? Oh, last time I was in here, you were shouting at me. That's because I like you. <laughs> well, I don't like you that way. Well, then we're all going to be alone. Good job. <laughs> Where are you going, Commander Gale? Back to Earth. But I must come with you. Uh, no. But I must, for I am in love with your crewmate, Leslie. That's impossible. You're an alien divided by five. Your people, though of superior intelligence, are incapable of feeling the emotion we on Earth refer to as love. Is it love when I think of him all day and dream of him all night? You dream of him at night? No, that's not love. We'd better get going, Commander. 
Give me a sec. But Commander, the space portal closes in 1300 nanobytes. Get off my back, pretty boy. <laughs> what were you saying? Is it love when I would rather die than live without him? Now you're just guessing. See ya. But... Let's go. What was that all about? Uh, she was gonna kill you and eat you. Yeah! Well, you stop worse than I do! I hate little kids! What kind of ass crap is this? Maybe I'm not hearing myself think, but I, th I told you, never set foot in store again. Yeah, well, I haven't left yet. <laughs> that shut him up. Hey, want to shoot hoops tonight? Yeah, bring the Dreamcast over to my house. Superman, Iron Man, Shows, and Bull Man, Aquaman, Sandman, Hawkman, Ant-Man, Giant Man, Machine Man, Spider-Woman, Superwoman, Wonder Woman, Wolverine, Swamp Thing, The Thing, Green, Arrow Green, Goblin Black, Widow Black, Adam Black, Man, The Dark Side, Man, Crawler, Moonlight, Abomination. Yeah.